okay hello guys uh, this is our farm automation system uh, as you can see here uh, we are just some led uh, with arduino boot and here is uh, gsm module <coughs> and here is our android app we're gonna control this uh, prototype uh, farm automation prototype from our android app uh, so let's start here on app you can see uh, an option content panel here you can see all your connected devices uh, such like lights and fans or other sensors uh, from this app you can uh, on off any light or any sensor easily okay let's uh, on light one okay it will take some time uh, here here you can see that uh, light one is on currently on now um, okay let's turn another light light two okay as you can see here uh, this light is little bit uh, low so as you can see here uh, this is uh, led 2 or uh, light 2 uh, this is currently on okay uh, let's try another uh, with light 3 okay it will take some time as usual okay here here you can see uh, light 3 is also on okay uh, so far we can control our lights uh, from our android app uh, so uh, you can also turn off them from your app uh, let's try led one or light one this one will turn off this light okay here here you can see uh, uh, light one is currently off now okay now we perform some actions or uh, uh, in our app so uh, the actions are gonna saved uh, if you close this application and get back to this application again and here you can see the uh, light two and light three is currently on you didn't off it and from back here you can see an user log uh, user log presents uh, the uh, log uh, about your uh, actions uh, you perform some actions uh, here okay so uh, there are also sensor connected with this uh, automation system uh, so let's uh, try with sensor uh, let's on light sensor okay light sensors um, is uh, currently on now uh, but for seeing the capability of light sensor you need to be a lower light intensity so we're gonna turn off our light okay here you can see that uh, the uh, another uh, led is on here so this led is gonna uh, work as a security led uh, in our farm automation uh, because uh, uh, the light sensor um, sense the intensity of light and if it's day and uh, the light gonna be off and if it is uh, night then the light gonna on automatically so okay uh, let's back to our 
day uh, as you here can see that this slice is automatically off so if you want to try it again let's see it again okay here you can see the light is automatically on again so so this is the uh, light sensors uh, capability okay uh, there is another sensor which is humidity sensor uh, which uh, can sense the temperature and humidity in our farm automation system so we're gonna use future use uh, this sensor uh, for uh, different kinds of motors and uh, for fans uh, now uh, for prototype use we used it in a LED so currently this sensor is off uh, as you can see here uh, we can turn it on okay we turn this on uh, uh, the humidity sensor uh, the sensor is performing as you can see here uh, that's it uh, that's our uh, full automation and there is some extra features in our uh, android app uh, as you can see uh, here is a report uh, report of current temperature of your farm automation uh, light intensity uh, is if it is day or night or the total appliance connected with your farm automation system you can uh, check the temperature and light intensity uh, from here so it, it will gonna take some uh, time to send back the request uh, so for this you can see you will log here uh, you on humidity sensor, you on light sensor, you on LED one. Uh, that's all reported are uh, tagged down here in user log. Uh, let's get back to C report. Okay, here you can see that the temperature is changed. Uh, it was 30, now it is 32. And here you can see light intensity is 147 and total appearance is 5 okay that's our farm automation system we developed this system for our final year project uh, for our defense uh, so we're gonna present it tomorrow tomorrow uh, wish us best of luck thank you all thanks